Linkronicity, where your journey and destiny link. I'm Stacey Kumagai, your Linkologist, and I'm here to help you link your life. Today we're going to be talking about a whole lot of links. <laughs> eight. Yes, eight links. We're going there. I know. It's a lot, right? Well, let me, let me break it down for you really, really simply. It's the link of knowing, but it's not the link of knowing that you know, or what I know, like, as an intuition know. It's the link of knowing as in the four links that link to your mind, body, soul, spirit. It's conviction, faith, trust, and belief. <laughs> These are the eight links I'm going to be talking about today. And you're like, why? Why is this necessary? Well, it's necessary because for these four links, mind, body, soul, spirit, to be aligned, you have to have conviction, trust, faith, and belief. And hand in hand, you've got something that you can work with. This is why we get confused. And this is why when we go from a place of knowing to not knowing, not as in the unknown not knowing, but as in to know that there's things that we don't know, and sometimes we don't even know what that is, but we know that we know something that can link it back together so we can get back to these <laughs> fabulous links. But it's these four links over here, conviction, faith, trust, belief, which get a little muddied. And do you know why they get muddied? They get muddied when we get to a crossroads. And our crossroads usually is saying, wait, wait a minute. Are you sure? Are you really sure? Do you know who you are? Do you know why you are at this place? And that's when we have to trust, right? That's when we have to trust. And then you're going to be asked the question, okay, so you know why you're at this place, but do you have the faith in letting things happen so you can actually have the conviction of knowing where you're going and then have the belief of knowing where you're going and above all, why you're going to be doing what you're doing? It's a lot, right? So, this is why we're talking about it. We haven't really broken it down this way before, but that's the landscape. That's why we have the crossroads to get us to the place of understanding why these four links are important for these four links, mind, body, soul, spirit, health, to be fully aligned within our journey. They work together. They're linked together. And when we actually do the inventory, we can then understand why they're necessary to work in partnership, to work for your highest good, your best journey, your best life, your best road um, of happiness and health and joy and really living. Okay, so I lied. There's <laughs> 12 links we're talking about. Um, but that's what it's all connected to. And this is your life. And you are so worth understanding all of these links. You are so worth um, taking the time to understand how it all works together. Life becomes more enjoyable that way when you get to a place of questioning, you know, what it is that you have conviction about, what it is that you trust in, what it is that you have faith knowing, and your belief of where you are going and why you're here and doing what you're doing. That's part of passion. Our passion within our souls can't really get to the place of the most escalated epitome of ecstasy and our joy and our happiness and our peace, our inner peace that's within us, unless we get to that place. So what I'm going to ask you to do is I'm going to ask you to write down a list of things. A list of things that you have pure conviction of who you are and what you want and why you're here. And then ask yourself how much trust you actually have. Not just in yourself, but trusting in the other links that I've talked about, like the unknown, trust in um, sitting in the void, trust in your own patience or, you know, trust in your own flow of how you're living your life, how you're functioning in your life, 
how you're operating your life and how you're realigning your life and having the check-in with yourself throughout your entire process. It's a connective process. And every video that I've shot here and every blog that I have written here all connects to a chain in your life. And we examine all of these little links. The ones that are working for us, the ones that are not working for us, the ones that are toxic, the ones that we need to purge, the ones that we need to shine up and polish, the ones we need to remove that are rusty. When we start to do all of these things within our life's journey, we now have a, a beautiful, beautiful life chain, and a tapestry that's colorful, that's meaningful. And that's the key, adding meaning. Because living life without meaning is empty. And we don't want to have an empty journey, right? So in order for your life to have meaning, you have to be able to understand all of these different places of where you are on these four links to align with these four links so you can have these four links <laughs> and live your life authentically in your truth with your heart, with all of your being. I'm Stacey Kumagai, your Linkologist, here to help you link your life. Please be sure to follow me on Facebook, Twitter, LinkronicityBlogspot.com, and go to Linkronicity.com for private coaching sessions. I hope you have a wonderful knowing.